Horn. So Mind Horn stars Julian Barat, S.C. Davis, Harriet Walker, and Simon Marfello. And Mind Horn tells the story of, my, of um, an actor who basically used to be a celebrity. He was on this 1980s show called Minor, a successful TV show, but he pissed off a lot of people during the production. And so his marriage fell apart, his friendship fell apart, and now he is, it, you can look, look ahead in time to see that he's middle-aged. Um, he's middle-aged and he's, he's losing all plot. And he seems to try, and, he's trying to be this hero that he used to be in TV show, the successful actor, and he's he is called on by the police of the Isle of Wight to help solve a murder case done by a person who believes that this guy is actually Mindhorn. Oh my god, I've never walked out of a film and I did in this one because this film is absolutely terrible. Absolutely terrible, it's really really bad. Julian Bratt plays Mindhorn. I I've never seen him anything anything again. I'm not saying he's a good act, bad actor. His acting was good, but I didn't. But you know, I didn't really like him in his character. He wasn't funny. He didn't make me laugh. It was absolutely shocking. I'm really surprised at Sam Marfello because you'll know him from horrible histories. Um, and he played um, he played Har Harriet's new boyfriend. Um, you know, he takes the piss out of. Um, out of um, out of mine home because the actor because he believes he's wasted space he didn't know what he's doing it and you know actually he was kind of funny it did give me giggles but again not not really there Harriet Walker plays Mindhorn's wife I love her back and forth. Uh, her back and forth is brilliant. I love the way that, you know, that she um, she brings a lot to the character, which is really good. Um, I like the way she just doesn't give a crap about him anymore. I mean, he keeps turning up in these awkward situations. You can tell she doesn't want anything to do with him. And the things he does in the movie is, is pretty, pretty bad. And you've also got, um, you've also got actors like Steve Carell and Simon Marfello as well. And you've got Essie Davis. Essie Davis plays one of the police officers that works with Minehorn. She has absolute faith in him. She thinks he can solve this case. But again, he kind of pisses her off. And this film is absolutely, sh absolutely shocking. I couldn't stand it. I hated it. I mean, there was times where I was sat there and I was like, when is this actually going to get interesting? Because it was boring and dull. Completely ridiculous. I didn't laugh at all. I, mean, I might have giggled a couple of times, but that was about it. Um, there was hardly any storyline. The jokes seemed to overcome the story. And the storyline was weird. It was wrong. It didn't work. There was no connection with characters at all. And I thought the guy who played the... You know, the obsessed fan was just weird and stupid. I mean, I've never seen worse acting than this, than what I saw in this. I think it's rubbish. It's a waste of time. I really did not like this. I hated it. I hated the direction. I hated the storyline. I hated the laughter. I hated the cat. I hated the connection between characters. And I just felt bored. I actually came out of it to think about what I'm doing tomorrow. And in a movie, you're not supposed to do that. So for all those reasons, I'm going to give Mindhorn a fuck you. If you do like com uh, comedies like this and you're a fan of Richard, if you're a fan of Richard Mayhope and you pretty like you like him acting and you like really bad, dark, really horrendous comedy, then then again you might like this. If you like it, comment me and tell you what you liked about it. If you like it, great. But me, I fucking hated it. So mind horn, have you guys seen it? What do you think about it? Please let me know in the comments below. And please subscribe to me with madness. Thanks ever so much for watching. If you do like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Share the video with friends. Thank ever so much for watching. You guys are awesome and I will see you when I review the next movie.